All right. Shall we talk about the thing that everybody in the world is talking about right now? I mean, the biggest pop star in the entire world that is now maybe in a relationship with one of the best players in the NFL. It's... How can we not? Listen, if you as a football fan were already sick of hearing about the Chiefs, Patrick Mahomes, Travis Kelsey, boy, do we have some bad news for you because it's not going to stop. It's now. never going away. Honestly, it will never go away at this point. Never. Even never. if they break up, it's a topic. The Chiefs, congrats to the Chiefs. I mean, like, they scored big with that one. It's, they really did. It's huge for them, especially. If- you know, mm-hmm. for a team that, like I said, people are kind of sick of hearing about. Right. And not I'm only have they been like a front runner for a very long time, because, you know, when people are bandwagoning, finding teams, they don't watch. Football, I feel like the, the Chiefs are a good choice to pick. Why would you not pick the Chiefs? Uh-huh. So they have that. Plus, they have the Swifties and they're winning. Good quarterback, good tight end, coach with the mustache and funny. I don't know what else you could Those ask. commercials are so good. The Andy Reid State Farm Andy commercial Reed is awesome. Crack me up every time. Um, I'm just like, I'm glad she had fun. I'm glad she genuinely had fun at that football game because, you know, she probably went into it thinking like, this is, this is a lot. This, the whole world is going to know that this is a thing. I'm going to be with his mom. And I love that so much. She just looked like she had a blast. The chest bump, I think was the best part of the whole thing after Kelsey (laughs) scored. You know, that guy that she was chest bumping. Who is it? A Cleveland man. Classic. Of course it is. Of course it is. I saw, because I saw one of my friends, he tagged the guy in the story and he was like, wow, this is your moment. <laughs> I was like, I don't even keep reposting it. So I'm happy for that guy. I love that. Um, does he know that there's an NFL reporter who asked if he was Dennis Rodman? Um, I'm probably, he happened. probably is aware. So yeah, uh, no, he wasn't Dennis Rodman. He was a man from Cleveland, Ohio. Uh, <laughs> so stupid. Breaking Taylor news, Swift. Dennis Rodman and Taylor Swift were not chest bumping at the Chiefs game. Just for anybody that was confused dumb but i think my favorite part about all of this is the swifties who may not have been football fans before or not even probably known who travis kelsey was until all of this the tweets are so good so good it's it's such good content i know people are tired of it but like just give us something to look forward to i'm sorry listen you can be tired of it all you want it's not going away so you better mute some words some key phrases something like that because for as long as they are alive now, they're always going to be tied to this and it's going to continue to get talked about. They don't even have to be seen together ever again. Nope. No. It was so awesome. Just real quick, though, imagine being the Bears. You're already really <sighs> bad. You're, you're having the worst week ever. Oh, no. Each day, something worse is happening to your team. And somehow, you have to play football with Taylor Swift watching you, the whole world watching you, and lose by – how many points did they lose by? 30? 30-something? What was it, 41-3 to three or something like that? I think they scored a touchdown at the end of garbage time, if you want to count it. Sure, we'll give them the extra points. They mm. could, I mean, they could use it. <laughs> Tough week to be a Tough. Bears fan, man. Tough. It's uh, To go out and get embarrassed is one thing. To go out and get embarrassed in front of the biggest pop star in the entire world. Uh, that's mm. tough. That's really tough. Um, we need to break down this video though of them walking out because I have I have a few I have a few things to point out. Okay. Um, First of all, uh, the fact that Walter Payton's son is the one who got who captured this video. Is it? I'm almost pos- I'm <laughs> almost positive. Um. <laughs> Well, that's that's been a week, so it's, that right there is just hysterical. Mm-hmm. Uh, the look Travis Kelsey gives him as they start to <laughs> like get in the camera shot is like, oh my god, dude, stop! You're embarrassing me. That's exactly you can't tell me otherwise. That's exactly the, the look that he's giving. And then they almost look like they're holding hands, but they're not. They're not. But they're holding not. Hands. They're not holding hands. Oh, I wish they would have been holding hands. I, Do you think oh, they even man. like met before that moment? I, th- I think so. Okay, I don't know. I just, uh, I don't know. The star of the show, though, I think is um, Donna. Regardless. Donna. She, what, what a day. What a day she for Mama Kelsey. She had an absolute 
time of her life. She looked like she enjoyed every single part of that game. 